What's up, everybody? Or, uh, no. What's up, Fox Fam? And what's up, Rice Gum Squad? Hey guys, it's me again. And for today's video, I got roasted. And honestly, it was by Rice Gum. So now. I'm mad. Good afternoon, guys. I got roasted by Rice Gum, and I'm gonna react to it today. Well, not wrong way. Little background story. So basically, the other day, I'm gonna do this really quickly because I'm sure you guys have all heard it. I tweeted Rice Gum, and kind of called him out, and then he tweeted me back and like made fun of me for DMing him a bunch of times in the past like six months. So it made me look weird. So anyways, I DMed him a bunch of times. He posted that, then we had like a little bit of Twitter drama for like an 10 minutes. It was on Scare, so I'm sure you guys have heard of it. And then he dropped a diss track on me. Yeah, he dropped a diss track on me, and I'm here to react to it because I think it'd be fun. Obviously, there's lots of Rice Gum fans watching this video, and I'm sure this is gonna get a lot of dislikes and um, comments that say L and other things Rice Gum's loyal fans do. So yeah, we were in the car and it came out. So I, I've avoided watching this video for like two and a half hours because I wanted to make a reacting video to it. So I have not seen anything from the video except for like one thing on Twitter that was like a teaser and then like a few screenshots of the video itself. I'm still subscribed to you, Rice Gum, because I, I still like you. Um, maybe we can get lunch someday. Right and early for the day. I want to make a few guesses to what he's going to make me f make fun of me for. I think he's going to make fun of... Uh, I, people have told me he's making fun of my acne, obviously. I've already thought of that. Uh, probably some good stuff about the scooter thing. What else would he make fun of for me? My, my voice. I saw a screenshot about my big old teeth. So there's going to be that. And... Alright. I'm, I'm literally so excited because I've been waiting for this for so long. Alright. Originally, I wasn't even gonna make this video, but I got so many people saying like, "Rice Gum can't wait for the Tanner Fox diss track," and I was like, "I wasn't gonna my name. make one," but now since everyone thinks I'm gonna make one, I can't let them down. So can't let them down. Oh, he told right me now. in the DM, guys, "Drop bangers, and don't and disappoint." I don't know why this keeps happening to me, but I got roasted again. Like literally, man. There's this kid named Tanner Fox. You put oh him. the acne. This kid is irrelevant. But oh, I'm irrelevant. All right, so I'm irrelevant. So I'm just gonna scroll down here. This is the top 24 hour gain. So I am, oh look, I'm 42. So we're gonna keep scrolling down. Uh, no sign of rice gun. Now saying, when dish tracks there get it is. old, so you make scripted Q and A's with famous girls. And this pisses me off a lot. Ha <laughs> ha, just <laughs> laughing at my face, making fun of me and my content, and that's not okay. Not okay. The funny thing is, I actually remember this kid from like five months ago. I have talked to him. Literally, I followed him on Twitter. I was like, you know what? He seems like an innocent, you know, innocent, nice kid. So I followed him on Twitter and- I have some bad news, guys. <laughs> he did unfollow me. The worst decision of my life, man. This kid non-stop. Okay, so he followed me. This is where it gets weird. Hitting me up. Me and Afro gonna be hanging out, just chilling, playing some checkers. Look at these messages, man. These are DMs, private messages from five months ago, not Photoshop. But uh, it's not Photoshop. Next time I'm in Vegas, we should grab lunch. It's nice talking with some other YouTubers, right? You know, no, no, no big deal. Asking me for a date, you know, whatever. A couple months. Later. I would love that. Yo, bro, I might come to Vegas tomorrow. Are you free for lunch? Figure it out. Yo, bro, you party tonight? Question mark, you know, trying to meet me at parties. That was at VidCon. <laughs> I look so desperate, this is so bad. So he's over here really- In my defense, this doesn't make me any less weird. This was like over a span of like six months though. At least it wasn't like, like all in- Really, you know, trying to be my friend, very interested, you know, he's like a really big fan of me. And yeah, two yeah. months later, he's over here talking shit on Twitter. It doesn't make sense. But after countless hours of research, I came to a conclusion. 6,000 subscribers every day. That's Struggling. pretty good. Not as good as me. Not as good as me. But that's still a good rate. No, not at all. Not at all. Out of nowhere, a week later, on August 8th, oh, sorry, August 6th, he gained 72,000 subscribers in one day. Ah. What the heck? How is that even possible? When I went to Roman's house. Bam. Roman Atwood vlog. He was featured in a Roman Atwood vlog. Roman gave him a shout out. Roman has like 9 million subscribers. He's freaking destroying the... Rice Gum, in my defense, once again, Roman did not give me a shout out. I was there for the Piazza family, um, uh, and they were doing their thing with the GTR. I was there, I didn't ask Roman to give me a shout out or anything, he didn't give me a verbal shout out, but he was nice enough to put my YouTube link in the description, so obviously I'm thankful for that. Game right now, but he gave Tanner a shout out, linked him in the description, and the day after, 
of August 6th, he gained 72,000 subscribers, and after that, he was gaining 40,000, 20,000, 20,000. Air Fox was struggling on YouTube. Oh, he God. Asking to go on a date. I kept curving. I was struggling back then in, in um, the beginning of August. Man, I only I think I was only gaining like 8k a day. I hope he feels bad for me. Later he got a shout out from Roman Atwood. Now he thinks he's hot shit. He's gaining his subscribers fast. Fame got to you, bro. Wow. Thinks he's Mr. Tough Guy and he's taking shots at me on Twitter. It doesn't work like that. You can't just come at me like that. I got so you. Maybe we should critique his content. He's gonna critique my content. Okay, let's see it. A hundred layers of Starburst. Super Original, oh huh? yeah, yeah. Wow, haven't seen that before. Knew it! <laughs> trampoline flips into pool. He's gonna call me out for trampolines. Whoa, this guy. Alright, let's see the videos. Okay, Tanner's up there. Trampoline pool party. Shake car. Insane trampoline flips off a bridge. Tanner Bronger, you're making up there twice, bro. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. He's up. Trampoline roof jump into pool. That's me in the thumbnail, dude. What are you doing? It says right there. Check out Tanner Fox's channel. I'm in that video. All right, no, I'll take it. The toilet paper for. Wow, super original. Oh, I've never seen that before. I have neither. Diving for one million subscribers. Oh God, man, that video meant a lot to me. Are you really bad to say? I know a bunch of YouTubers did it. There it is, ready. This guy's a genius. He does get rejected a lot. We're doing flips for a kid. So if we both impress you with doing a flip, you have to give us a kiss on the cheek. No. no. <laughs> We're struggling out here. We're struggling. We're struggling. Crazy. If you, it's just a kiss on the cheek, man. Come that on. voice cracked. I didn't impress the flip. Maybe. Did I win? Ding, ding, ding. Oh, no, I didn't win. I remember this. No. Wrong. But if you think about it, these two girls got an L, and the party killer, she low-key dodged the bullet because, like, that's Tanner's cheek right there. True. And you can pay me a million dollars. The point I'm trying to make is I just don't understand why he's calling me out on my videos and my content when he should be worrying about his content because his content isn't anything too great. I mean, all he does is just replicate people's ideas. Uh -huh. I mean, it's really nothing too hard that he's doing. Anyways, bottom line too is... Too hard. Rice gum. Fox, if you're watching this... I'm watching it. this track's really getting old, though? Oh, he has a scooter! Scooter, uh, well, this Tanner kid, like, he does a lot of scooters. Oh, of course he puts him doing a 180. I didn't even know scootering is still a thing, but... Yes, he puts yeah, he scootering in it! Anyways, enjoy! <laughs> yes, he's at a skate park, dude. You a salty fanboy, and I know that. Is it Tanner or Rufus the Mora? There it is. Keith. Bro, can you stop the M in me? No. no. Oh, I can't now. You unfollowed me. You be friends with me. All those pimples on your face, man, you know that's an issue. You went to the beach and you begged girls to kiss you. The I did that. For kisses from to me, not a challenge. You bought a GTR, you should have bought some proactive. He's right. He's right. Why did I waste all my money on that? Where's the reason why your vid went viral? I don't have a brother. Boring ass vlog and some clickbait titles. That's true. You talk about my vids when all your content is vlogs. I thought your face was a game of connecting the dots. Damn. Yeah, I'm at four mil and you still at one. Can you please stop asking? We ain't going to lunch. I know that now. Your videos are ass and your ideas are stolen. The only reason you got subs is that shout out from Roman. Dump I, f I just feel like a dick even if I was like defending myself, but I did have one. 0.2 million subscribers before I went to Romans, but I did get all my subs from Roman. That does make sense. So I was by myself with nobody to help me. Take a look at my skin. That's what it's like to be healthy. I don't know. Don't tweet at me again, you little f ass loser. Oh. If you do that shit again, I'm gonna kidnap your scooter. You can't do that. I'm in Kansas. Dude, Try to get it. My word and like you said, you're gonna take his scooter and like that's like his prized possession. Right, like, right. Come back to me. Main Africa. Shit like that, dude. Oh shit. Yeah. Should we just take that part out or something? Nah, man. You can't take it back now, man. You already said. <laughs> I was gonna end this video before not even give my like personal opinion on the video because I just thought like I'm gonna get hate comments, which is I'm gonna get hate comments regardless because of Rice Gum's fan base. I was honestly kind of disappointed. I was hoping, I was so excited to watch this because I thought it was gonna actually like offend me and I was actually gonna get butt hurt. All you did, six out of your like ten lines were about my acne. So like that didn't offend me. I'm already used to YouTube comments saying that. But the scooter thing, super original. Haven't heard that growing up at the skate park for six years. Oh look, you wanted popularity from rice gum uh, you wanted <laughs> you wanted subscribers and blah, blah blah I'm gonna have that side of things and then if I'm if I'm actually upset about it or I'm actually like reacting to it like I'm doing now uh, you're gonna say oh you're butthurt you're so salty about it bro I can totally tell you're salty about it could have come up with some more original content but I think I'm gonna end this reacting video here I hope you guys enjoyed be on the lookout for that diss track um, 
But thanks for watching. If any of the Rice Gum fans watched to the end, I'm kind of proud of you guys because I, I, I figured a lot of you would just click on the video to dislike it. If you stayed to the end, thank you. I love you, and I'll see you guys in my next video.